Hey everybody, this is Anime Free Chaos. Welcome back to the Legend of Heroes Trails of Cold Steel 2. Uh, before we start, let me see if my monitor is rock working right. <laughs> Sorry, bad start. Uh, let me see here. All right, might as well do a quick test now. Okay, sound test is good. All right, anyway, so we are back, guys. So let's see. Uh, check our notebook here from last time. If I remember, if memory serves me right, we basically did a little bit of leftover stuff that was back in Berea Hard. You know, did some fishing. Uh, we then moved on to Ruer, which um, I took the advice of my friend, you know, just to check it out with Elisa. And uh, after exploring any changes in Ruer, basically we found a hidden side quest at Jackass's shop of all places. And it turns out um, we had to, basically the mission was to fix a pocket watch that Elisa's father uh, made for the mom, for, you know, Elisa's mother. But of course it broke somehow. And basically we were on a fetch quest to get the, you know, proper things to fix the watch. And hilariously enough, the last item was a piece, like a very sm small piece of the Zumerian ore, which we got from George. Uh, long story short, we fixed it, presented it back to the mom, and we got it back. Uh, or, I mean, we got a quartz in return, like a rare quartz. But uh, we gave it back to the mom, and of course, it was a nice ending to that side quest. I personally think it was, just because um, it kind of showed that, you know, honestly, even though the mom, Elisa's mom is such a, a stick in the mud sometimes, she does care for Elisa. We know that. But uh, other than that, though, I think in terms of questing here, uh, let's see, we have two more to go. There's one at Lohengrin Castle in Lagram, and there's um, this one in Celtic. To be honest, I do want to get started on the Celtic quest just because I'm very curious about it. Um, I also got comments about, like, you know, finding the, the uh, what do you call it? I'm snapping my fingers here. Uh, the cryptids, yeah. They were, we also fought uh, one of the cryptids back in... Um, in the oh shoot, what's the place called? Nord Highlands. Yeah, I drew a blank there. Sorry. Um, oh yeah, that's also what we did last time. Sorry, my bad. We also went back to the Nord Highlands to check out Zender Gate, the the tower, and uh, you know the settlement of uh, Gaius's family. And pretty much, you know, everything's going back to normal. They're, they're starting to move their family back into the old settlement. Uh, and of course, Gwyn's gonna hang around with them for a while. Um, what else happened? Yeah, we fought the third cryptid. We got another rare quartz. I haven't decided who to give it to yet, but I get to get some nice feedbacks. So thank you guys. Um, other than that, I don't think there's anything else right now. It's just the cycles that we might start working on right now. And in terms of the plot, though, um, basically it's the spirit shrines and whatnot. But I think we'll handle the, you know, spirit shrines are the part of the storyline. So we'll wait on that. Um, in terms of our team, I think I'll keep guys around for a little longer. I kind of want to switch them out with... Um, well, I don't know, because I, like I said, I want to get started on that Celtic side quest, but we probably need Elliot, so I think I will have to take out Gaius. Um, you know what? Yeah, let's go ahead and do that now. And, of course, it's not fair to Elliot, because we haven't been using him at all lately. So let's go ahead and change our party first. So, all right, so sorry, Gaius, once again, you're out, and Elliot is in. Uh, what else? Anything new from Toa? Uh, the Azure Tree's de appearance is definitely spooky, but we can't stop us from doing what we have to do. We need to recenter our efforts on the Spirit Trends and get up all the students that were still waiting out there. And if we're lucky, we'll help soothe the minds of some of the Erebonians who are freaking out about it, too. In other words, let's just keep on doing what we do best. Okay. Oh, wait. Was there anything else, though? Uh, keep doing what we do best. All right. So we already did talk to her. Um, before that, um, let me check. Hmm. Sorry, I'm taking a quick look here. Did people have changed? position i don't remember from last time i don't think so but let me go ahead and quick let me do a quick check around everyone let's see fees over here angelico anything new all right obey my every command okay no that's the same all righty so let's quickly explore the uh parts of the ship very briefly whoops i wonder if we get anything special from alfin because um we still haven't really gotten much in terms of metals i think we got one but we still haven't gotten the other two yet let me quickly talk to her uh looking forward to okay no same thing about the blade Okay. Because didn't Rex join us? That's what I'm trying to remember. I think it was Rex, but I forgot what part of the ship he's on. But anyway, we got all three friends here, so let's go ahead and quickly talk to them. I just remember that. All right. Emily's more excited than ever now that Teresa's with us, too. Now all we need to do is find Ferris. That's probably easier said than done, though, especially if she's still at the Academy. That's true. What else? Where are you, Ferris? Knowing her, she's probably fine. She has to be. Okay. Anything else from Melissa? All right, and then, of course, uh, Emily. All right. Heh, <laughs> there's nothing we can't do. We got our friends working with us. So I hope you're ready for our training to beat the hell out of you, Reen. But we wouldn't do it if, it if you couldn't overcome it. Okay, anything else? Uh, now that Teresa's here, the training's gonna be harder than you ever imagined. 
Hope you're ready, Reen, because it's going to get real intense. Okay. So, in regard to that, I think we should do the Comet training. Maybe not in this session. Maybe another time, though, because I do want to get through more of the uh, different levels. I don't know. Of course, I'm, I'm going to assume they're going to get much harder from here on. But anyway, here's Teresa. Emily and I have been tweaking the settings of the combat shows together. Thanks to that, you're going to have to... You're going to have a few new training... Ex yeah, excuse me. <laughs> Sorry. I'm rushing here. <sighs> okay. Thanks to that, you're going to have a few new training exercises on offer. Do come and try them if you get the chance. They won't be easy, but I'm sure they'll benefit you in the long run. We'll have to give them a shot. I'll let Lisa and Elliot know, too. Hee <laughs> hee. Thank you. Anyway, when you want to try your hand at some high-level training, just come and let me know. Okay. Oh, look at that. Okay, so... <clears throat> so Emily has the uh, ones to three, but Teresa has the higher level ones. Okay, gotcha. All right, anything else, though? I'm so happy that Emily and I are back together again. And now that I'm here, I should be able to make myself useful. That's more than I can say for my time at Berea Hard. Hehe, <laughs> it's wonderful to see Elisa again, too. All right. Uh, you might not know it by looking at us, but Emily and I were the terrors of the ranged training back at the Academy. Not to worry, of course. I'll be sure to keep her from getting too competitive. Really now? Okay, wow. That's unexpected, but cool. <laughs> Alright, so over here... Let's see. Alan and... Okay. Let's see, Alan. Uh, uh, I, I did it! That's the way! Nice work! Now that you worked off some of that rust, you up for a quick sparring session with a combat shell? You bet! Okay, and what else? Now that I've been reunited with Bridget, I got no time to waste. I gotta get as strong as I can so I can keep her out of harm's way. Anything else? All right, and then uh, logins. I swear, as soon as he was reunited with his gal pal, his skill level shot right up. Who would have thought that a puppy love was a secret sauce? Kind of makes me feel like, <laughs> kind of makes me feel like all of the training I've been putting him through was a big waste of time. Uh, still, if he if he's got something that works for him, that's all that matters. People don't get stronger if they don't if they don't something worth what? People don't get stronger if they don't have. <laughs> You're supposed to have have. So people don't get stronger if they don't have something worth fighting for. Family, country, girls, whatever drives you. Bit of an odd typo, but it's okay. <laughs> Sorry, I'm not going to go grammar Nazi on you guys. Don't worry. Anyway, um, I think Hibble's over here, right? Let me talk to him. Hibble? Uh, what's this I hear about a request that the Wind Orchestra can help with? Now that we all reunited, I'm sure we can do good for the people of Keldic. Just let us know if we can help. Ah, okay, so... Alright, so I definitely gotta make a reminder to come back here on the ship to ask Hibble. Because I think I think he is he might be required for the quest anyway. Because he is uh, one of the leads in the orchestra, the Wind Orchestra Club. Okay, so now, don't worry, we'll be very brief, guys. Sorry. I don't want to take up too much time on the damn ship, like usual. Because <laughs> that happens often. Oh, okay, here's Rex. Here we go. I had a feeling this ship was gonna be cool, but damn! It's got more babes on board than any ship's got a right to, too. And they're all doing stuff they wouldn't do at the Academy. It's a perfect blend of old and new. Okay. I had no idea Fidelia was here before you brought him to me either. Now I'm, now I'm wishing I'd taken you up on your offer earlier. I don't know if I got enough photo quartz for all the pics I want to take. <laughs> okay. And of course, uh, Elliot and Gaius here. Let's see, Elliot. The Azure Tree is scary, but there's really nothing we can do about it right now. Her problems take care of. Uh, Kelly. Okay, yeah. So that's the same. Anything new with Gaius, though? Eastern Arabonia, okay, Storm, yep, okay. Him and his wind puns, seriously. <clears throat> okay, and of course, uh, a couple people over here, right? Let's see. Oh, yeah, uh, what did we get from the uh, thing? Here we go. Well, first talk to him. Uh, Sensei Radio's Tristus struggling on. Okay, uh, status update. Oh, you want to know how your last contest entry went? Neat, you got the silver prize. I guess this is something. Ground bait times three. Oh, that's it, uh, okay. It's, uh, it's something, all right. I'll let you know if I want to apply again, though. All right, so, how much mirror do I have, actually? I have enough for another one. Hold on, was it a thousand? I forgot. A thousand mirror? Eh, I guess. All right, here we go. We'll do it again. All right. Okay. So, let's see, Usus. Uh, singing about future Berea hard, overcome my brother, blah, blah, blah. Okay, same thing. Um, let me see. Let's check out the shops quickly. All right, and Laura and uh, Emily. Anything new? Should begin to prove that it's been removed from the war. Pale imitation of my father. Hope. Okay. And then, uh, oh, Monica. 
Let's see, Brayheart freshly liberated. You can feel how the war situation has changed. Big part. Keep on with what I'm doing. I forgot, if I offer him, do they actually take him off the list? I think they do. All right, we'll do that later. I know, I keep holding off on it, but it's fine. Cheers for everything, you lot. The will next change will happen to Kelly, but I should be able to... Okay, no, we talked about that last time, too. Okay, trade. Uh, let me see. Ground bait, I have... Really? Oh, wait, no, 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 sorry. <laughs> I'm looking at the wrong thing. Um, all right, coloring. I got a bunch... I think I got one of each, I think, right? No, two, two, two. Oh, I got two of each. Oh, wait, except for the bunny and bear. Okay. Let me see. And then quartz. And then these. Okay. Same deal. And then Hugo. Anything new from Hugo? Uh, incredible work over at Orox 4. Truly masterful stuff. Uh, good still. Energy. Blah, blah, blah. Liberated. Uh, have to believe in bliss. Okay. And of course, these things are still out of our money range. Which is fine. Okay. Let's see now. Wait, what was that? Oh, clothing designs. Cool. <laughs> Let's see. And then these shops over here. Oh, look at that. I totally forgot we recruited um, Colette. Wow, look at all these Look at all these things, man. Seriously. All right, hold on. Before that, let's quickly talk to uh, these guys. All right, Klein. Uh, heading back to the bridge in a minute, but I wanted to check up on Casper. Uh, okay, no, we already talked about him about that. Uh, anything new in his shop, though? Uh, focus on the job. All right, shop. I did say I wanted to get a new bow for uh, Lisa. But I think I'll wait a little bit longer again. Um... Same thing, same thing for um, Emma and... God, like, <laughs> it sucks because I had to prioritize certain people on what they want to get, you know? I hate doing that sometimes, but it's kind of true. Let's see. And look, excellent coat and excellent boots. So, like, Fee's already good with the Stregas, but, like, she could definitely use an extra... A new coat and stuff like that. Everyone, technically, everyone could benefit from new equipment. That's, that's pretty much the question there, but... It's even in this game, you're still limited on what you can buy. But anyway, let's talk to Colette. Cool. All right. I'll be selling stuff I picked up on Artisan Street from here on out. I'd rather be on the buy side of things than the sell side. But what can you do? Some of my stuff's pretty rare, too. So you might want to take a look. Ooh, really? Okay, what else? I'm going to be selling stuff from... Oh, same thing. Some of it's pretty rare, so you might want to take a look. All right, let's see what she's selling. Colette's Cuteness Shop. Okay. Um... Pastel blue coloring, blue coloring, and pink coloring. So, ooh, so we got two new colors. Are you, I'm gonna buy them right now. There's one. There's two. Okay. Um, ride along bear, bunny, ears, evil mishy plushy. <laughs> but look, at, okay. So look, I could have actually, I could have bought these in her shop. So, I wouldn't say it's a waste of money, but still, it's kind of like if I knew it, this this would have been more convenient. But it's okay. Uh. Anyway, Evil Mishy plushie, so Strength 20 and Arts 20. A plushie of Evil Mishy, another mascot of Michelam Wonderland. Wow, it's 4,000 Mira, though. Shit. Okay, um, Silver Chain. All right, all these bracelets. Okay, so basically this is some of the stuff that Becky was selling, but you can actually buy with Mira, not, like, with trading, though. Which is fine. But uh, still, depending on which one, they're a little pricey. Let's see, Holy Spear. Or Sphere, sorry. Yellow Emblem. Oh, right, the emblems were the better ones, I think. Yeah, so defense 50, art defense, seal, mute, and stat down. Okay, yeah, dark emblem. Wow, she's got she's got good stuff. It's just I'm... I gotta conserve my mirror, unfortunately. <laughs> okay, cool, though. Very cool. So hopefully she'll get more stuff in the future, too. All right, so that's it for the third floor. Let's quickly go down to the remaining floors. I know, guys, I apologize. I just said I wasn't gonna hang around too much on the, on the ship, but look at me, it's like almost 15 minutes now. So we're just going around here. And then Million was trying to work the pole, right? Let's see. Wow, that came out wrong. I'm, I apologize. I, I meant to say Q, Q stick, but I said pole. You, you get what I mean. I'm sorry, guys. Ugh. Okay, anyway. Um, blade, I think we don't need to do, right? Yep, still full. So now it is... Oh, yeah, Margarita. How's she doing? Uh, oh, okay, Trista. So, And she's the peculiar dishes, right? Okay. Let's see, what else is there? Alright, uh, the professor, and then there's Dorothy. Anything new from Dorothy, though? Let me see. Uh, oh no, not this one. Uh, shop. Okay, now I already got those. Cool. Let's see, Instructor Thomas. Alright, Azure Tree, same 
Same dialogue. Uh, who's this? Fidelio. Uh, have Rex on the Courageous. You can tell how much this war has matured him, too. Okay. It does mean good to have Rex on the Courageous with us. Okay. Uh, shop. The liquids. Okay. The putrid liquids. Super disgusting. Uh, let's see. Oh, here we go. Uh, Bridget. Reen, could I possibly ask you for a favor? Nope. No asking allowed. I'm kidding. Of course you can. Wow, that, I was about to say, that was completely out of Reen's character for a second there. <laughs> er, thank you. It's about Alan, actually. As I'm sure you know, he's done a lot of... He's done a lot for me since we first started dating. I want to show him just how much I appreciate that. That's really nice of you. Got anything in mind? Well, yes, I'm thinking of cooking for him. All the housework I did in Berehart helped boost my confidence in the kitchen. Okay. So I like to surprise him with a really special homemade meal. I have a feeling he'd like that. I can see him jumping for joy already. The only issue being, I have absolutely no idea what I should make for him. That's where you come in. Could you bring me some dishes that you'd consider unique that I can sample? You wouldn't have to you wouldn't have to do this right away, of course. Just whenever you're free. If that's all you need, then sure. If I see you're tasting anything particularly unique, I'll bring it straight to you. Hehe, <laughs> thank you. It's a big help. Okay, wait, so... So not only Monica and Margarita, so now Bridget needs food too? Hold on. Alright, I could hardly believe it when I heard that Alan... Al, excuse me. I could hardly believe it when I heard that Alan's the ship's gunnery officer. Hee <laughs> hee, he's grown so much while we've been apart. I'm really impressed. I'll have to take a page out of his book now that I'm part of the crew too. Alright, what else? Uh, everything Alan's done while I've been gone is so impressive. So now that I'm part of your team too, I'll have to follow his lead. All right, wow, look at that. So, offer unique dishes. Ah, okay, so grilled onigiri, the harmonic juice. So, wait, is this the blue, the best stuff? Sorry, guys, give me a second here. I just want to double check. So, we go to the top here. So, let's see. Okay, so, on the results, so it's going to be the fourth item. So, like, harmonic juice, grilled onigiri. So, the, for those, and then it was Monica for, like, the tricolor onigiri, and like Esmelsa's juice, like the best stuff. And then for Margarita, it was like the like the bitter juice and like tough onion gear. Okay, so wow, so three people need that now. And wait, am I missing something? Fruit parfait. Oh, that's right, the the manly munchies. Hang on. Let me see. It's the curry, right? Here we go. The book contains a recipe. Obtain the recipe for spicy curry. I feel like, I know I was forgetting something. Hang on. So just to double check again. There it is, spicy curry. Okay. Um, all right, we'll worry about the food later, though. So now, cause Instructor Sarah, anything new? Uh, one of the nice things about the developments over here in Air Eastern Arabonia. All right, Jaegers. Uh, yep. Okay, same thing from last time. Uh, Celine, anything new? Uh, Azure Tree is pretty weird, but like you said, it's not our problem. Okay. And then Emma. Uh, nothing we can do but keep working on the spirit shrines. Okay. Uh, let's see, Nicholas. Uh, traveling? Okay, yeah. Talk about the food, too. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, do I need to buy any of these? Like, any food ingredients? I don't think so. Nope, we're good. Okay, last but not least, here is Kenneth. Uh, pretty sure my brother's just chilling in Crossbell. <laughs> okay. So, it's funny, because I think one of you guys told me that, uh, you actually meet his brother in one of the older games, which is kind of funny to know. Um... Bayako and Breeze. I still want to try to get one of these, at, or both of these at some point, but I need 700, so I'm going to keep on fishing for now, though. Okay. So now, let's see, did I already go in here? I already went in there. This is the, this is where we met, what's his face? Stefan. Let's see. Uh, George asked if I could analyze some Zumerian ore for him, but I don't really fancy my chances of finding anything new. At least I haven't so far. It's fascinating, though, like nothing I've ever seen before. Okay. Uh, show monster guide. Might as well. See if we get anything new. Uh, that's it in the system now. Thanks, Reen. If you got any more info. Okay. So nothing new again. So last but not least, uh, let's go ahead and go to the first floor. I know, guys. I apologize. It's like almost 20 minutes now. <laughs> but that's it's hard, though, because there's so much... You always find something new on the ship, so it's... I don't think it's a waste of time, but I feel like I should have done this a lot earlier. But anyway, um, all right, same thing with the trials, ornaments, nothing new in this department. 
Oh, that's right. Didn't I get new cords last time, too? I know there's a couple. Let me double check. Oh, wait, hold on. So, Clamea Solarian, okay. And then it was, what was the other one? Seraphic Ring, that was the one we got. I think I was going to give that to Elliot at some point. And then this Altair Cannon. That's the one I was talking about for Elisa. I think she learns that in Seraphic Ring. And there was something I, I asked you guys, too, about the, uh, the uh, EP Cut 2. Because I think... Um, I, I think when you answered, like one of you guys, I, I think it was Red Guy, you said that you can stack two of these, but you can apply both EP Cut 1 and 2 if I wanted to uh, for a character. Hmm. So, because I was trying to do that for maybe Elisa, because um, she's a good arts user. Like, seriously, she, she has the damage, but the problem is, like, her EP drops dramatically. So, that's the thing. Same thing with uses, too. I just wish there was a way to recover their EP uh, gradually, just like how Elliot and uh, Emma does, but oh well. I'll, I'll figure it out at some point. All right, Clara. Let's see. This piece is almost complete, which means it's about time for me to start thinking about my next one. Okay, yeah. She asked about that last time. Like, oh, do you have any spare Sumerian ores? <laughs> All right, uh, before we move on, check the bike one more time here. Because we got those two new colors, right? Oh, look at that. So we're only missing one more. Very nice. All right, so hold on. So we got the windy color. Guys approved. Here's the pastel blue coloring. Let's see. A light blue orbital bike coloring for the mass market taste. Eh, that's not bad. I like the little wing thing on the top of the bike, though. Uh, let's see. Pastel pink coloring. A cute light pink orbital bike coloring. Wow. It's even got hearts on the front. <laughs> and, of course, we got the Lisa we were using. We already used to be. Um, should I go with to Toa? Nah, you know what? Let's go. Let's be a little different. Let's actually go with the pink. <laughs> That's right. We're rolling with the pink pastel coloring. Hell yeah. <laughs> uh, all right, Paula. Let's see. Um, okay, sell the dead. That's the same thing. Um, last but not least, just talk to Valimar here. Uh, armaments made from... Okay, no, that's the same. All right, guys. So, unfortunately, it is almost time <laughs> to split the part. Again, I apologize once again. But, you know, like I said a few minutes ago, it's worth exploring the ship just to see if there's anything do new, which we did find new. Um, so, actually, let's at least go to the bridge. And I guess for the next minute or so, instead of going right away, let's actually use this time to um, do some quick cooking here. Let's see. So, notebook. Let's see. Recipe. Anything we can make, because I feel like we need to make a couple of variations of certain items. Wow, I'm actually maxed out on shit in this shell. Shit. Okay. Um, let's see. Who have we not cooked yet? Because I'm still trying to figure out who has, like, the crowns for the rare food. So, like, for this one, it's not no one in our party, but let's check with, like, Emma here. Maybe Elliot. Let's I see. Hope this turns out okay. He used to be the best for the omelets in the first game, too. Oh, this looks pretty nice. Queen omelet. Okay. Now let's try Emma. Sure, I'd love to. It looks great. Oh, okay. Uh, tomato jelly. Let's try All Elisa. Right, let's get started. <gasps> this looks delicious. All right, one more. This time, Laura. I certainly use the practice. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's see. Let's keep going. Let's go down the list a little bit more. Let's see. What else can we cook? Let's cook the new stuff. We might as well. All right, sweet blue. Tomato stew. Oh, okay. Emma was... All right, spicy curry. Here we go. So let's go ahead and try... Oh, we got a couple of candles. Let's try Sarah. <laughs> I've got this. <laughs> See? What did I tell you? All right, special curry. Let's try... Laura? I certainly use the practice. I'm proud of this one. Aha, sincere beef rice. Look at that. Cool. So from that one, you gain 7,000 HP and regain 20% HP with speed and... Wow. All right. All right. One more for the road. Let's do um, Emma. <laughs> sure, I'd love to. And then for the battle, we'll make, we'll make Reen cook it. <laughs> it looks great. If I... Let's see if he fails. Okay, let's give this a try. Cook it, Reen. Do it. There we go. Oh, that's surprising. Okay. Um... Fruit parfait. Here we go. Let's do. Let's do I Elliot. This turns out okay. <laughs> this is my specialty. Okay, cool. Harmonious parfait recovers 3,500 HP. Wow, look at that guy. Strength, defense, arts, art, defense, and speed. Wow, you get all. You get all those buffs, man. That's that's probably worth making. <laughs> I definitely will at some point. Let's get started. 
cool. Very nice. Huh? Thank goodness. All right, some fruit parfait. What else? I Flora? can certainly use the practice. <laughs> that came out rather well. Cool. Divine gelato. All right. 4,000 HP, 200 EP, and you uh, you cure for KO. Nice. All right. Last but not least, Instructor Sarah. <laughs> I've got this. Okay. I don't think so, but let's see. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> That's our excuse. Okay. Um, let's do one more time okay, with Rain. Let's give this a try. I want to see if I can get that failure. There we go. Okay then. All right, guys. So I'm gonna go ahead and split the part now, and then I believe um, I will decide on which side quest to start next. Again, sorry for taking too much time on the on the courageous, but again, for the third time now, we just want to explore, and see any, any changes or anything new. All right, I'll stop talking about it. I'll stop repeating myself now. But uh, anyway, uh, give me one second here to split the part. Let the system save. And then we will, I will decide on what quest to do next. So give me one second here, and then we will be right back. <laughs> 